I haven't been in this area before, but I know it is west of that cloth trader. And it's a forest area, so there's going to be wolves. This is gonna suck. A really stupid idea to be going through here. But you know, this is a pine forest. And I don't think this chunk was generated. So it might have more resin. Find it. I still have things I can throw away. Or, you know what, maybe... I won't be able to find resin because over there is the trader. It, like, yeah, I can see the trader from over here. It's on my crosshairs right there. Top right of it. So this chunk probably was generated, but... Here we go. Resin. I have a block that I can throw away. Why don't I just explore this area just a little bit? Go a little bit deeper. Actually, pretty thick. Gonna have to light this up. If I light these blocks on fire, do they generate heat for me? Yes, they do. Okay, so they make this all nice and toasty for me. And then we'll head to the. Okay, so it's this. Block in front that's preventing me, preventing me from burning this. Oh come on, really? Like the fire went out before spreading. Oh resin, look at that. Ladders up. Yeah, we should probably like run through here. Try to find as much resin as possible. Nice and toasty. Tread carefully. Don't see any more resin. Trying to examine all of these trees from a distance. I don't see any like orange marks on them. And of course, this is a granite area. The pro picket. Okay, there's really nothing here. Spalerite. I believe Spalerite. Just butchering that name. I think that's the other type of iron ore. Magnetite, uh. Something tight and spac. Spa I get. Forget it. I'm not gonna try to pronounce it. I'm gonna explore here. There's like nothing here, so. All right, let's just go directly to the trader. Thirteen forty-five, and I'm still warm, so that's good. Already going too far. So we'll cross this, uh, I guess, land bridge over here. We'll head to the trader, and then from there we'll head home. Got 
two extra resin. At this point, do I even need it though? Pretty much have all of our automation. At this point, I'm just casually looking for resin, but I don't think we need it anymore. Yeah, let's head over the trader now. Oh, here we go. Here's some resin. Oh, and we do need, like, flint. Like, I did say I was gonna get some flint, and then I just ended up not getting flint. Wasn't even looking for it. Just need to get past this area and then I'll be able to, to see the trader. Oh, did I just uh, go too far? The trader's over there. That definitely went too far. But I do want to go into this cave. Yeah, there's the surface copper node. The first one that I got. You want to dig around here. Check out what this area has. Decent hematite. So, there's a chance we could find iron in here. And it's actually closer than the trader over there, but the difference is, I actually know where iron ore is. I mean, we could find iron ore here. Now, I know this trader sucks, but I'm just going to check what he has. We haven't been here in a while. We're in the area, so might as well just take a look. Clothing trader, you have nothing warm for me to wear. It's just like fashion accessories and stuff like that. You have nothing warm. So, you're useless. See, this is why I didn't want to, like, go here anymore. It's a useless trader. So all we have to do is go in this direction and then we'll be home. You know, let's go past by this area over here. Yeah, this is a hole I covered up. And then there was another hole somewhere over here where I accidentally fell in but managed to escape. Just need to find it again. Find it while not falling in again. Yeah, like where? Oh, it's over there. Yeah, this is the hole. There's my block of packed dirt. I'm just gonna collapse this. Not much collapsing action. Samples. Sample. Yeah, there's like nothing down here. Not worth it. Like, pretty much just rule out exploring these caves, even though they probably still have ruins. Last 
last time I was here, there was like some rye over there that I didn't get because my... I've only been through here like once. And I do know there's like a wolf around here. Last I checked. At least over this hill right here. And somewhere in that region over there. Now can I see my house from here? Possible to see my house from here? No, it's not visible. I did pro pick this area once, but I forgot what's over here, so I, I should check again. Sample. Hi, Bismuth team. Yeah, that's why I was saying this area around here is high in Bismuth, because high quality Bismuth, but not really a high frequency of it. Here's my beehives over here. Wild beehives, at least. Don't need it. And then there's the meteoric iron deposit, like right here. Also, don't need it. We still haven't found borax. Like, the only resource we haven't found yet is borax. So, can't do anything. Just need to get onto our path here. There we go. Head back. Oh, that was a good trip. Got some tin, got a lot of bauxite. And I brought the gravel back for some reason. Fucking hell. Alright. We are back home. I'm just gonna put all of this bauxite in here. This is still going on. So, this is going to take a while, isn't it? Oh, come on, really? You have to do that game? So, we'll just keep this going for the time being. Stores bauxite stones, bauxite rocks. So we got all of this stuff. All right, I'm I'm gonna just gonna make some bronze. So we only got 48 nuggets out of that, but we can like. Do something with the bronze here. We do have lots of tin bronze shovels though, so probably make a... Well, I'm gonna avoid making the shovels. We'll just do the pickaxes and the long blades. Still have some copper in here. Twenty-one seventy-five. 
got to be an easier way to do this. Yeah. Okay, so we'll do 2100. Plus, we can like... Like, try to save my tin here. Max this out. Six. Okay, we just saved a lot of tin. Still have fifteen. All right, let's heat this up. Save this tin for later. What? Oh. Did I come out of range? Yeah, I can't hear it over here. So I can only hear it in this general circle. Kind of weird though. Oh, I do need charcoal. We'll do 16. It's gonna really get hot. Let's put the rest of this stuff away. So we have 13 resin, 10 fat. Still ready to go. Uh, what should I do in the meantime? Maybe I should get another charcoal pit going, or... Maybe I should work on the roof. I do need to be close by, just in case, but... Uh, I forget how long I made this. Okay, let's start with 14 for the time being. Okay, I'm just gonna put this over here now, just in case. Oh, come on! There we go. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Now, I need to go back down, get that other one. I really don't want to waste it. Also need some food. Uh, it'll be a while. You up here? Go go. That was the last meal. Okay, I'm gonna have to get pots up. Well, I guess we're not really cooking anything anymore, are we? Leave it here. Okay, one, two. So, one, two, three. So we'll just save the one remainder for roof over there. 
In the meantime... Let's do this. Let's continue filling out this roof here. We've already done the sides here. Oh. Actually, I ran out of material. We do the other side. Oh, uh, yes, we did. So we just need to fill in this area over here. We're gonna need a lot of fire clay shingles. I did say I was going to make more of it and I was doing some automation in here. Let's keep this going. I'm probably gonna have to put like another thing of ladder here. Another thing of ladder. It's a good name for it. Alright, how are you doing? Halfway, okay. So, they're still going. But probably should, like, actually we can't. I just realized I just burned all of the glass in there. Yeah, fuck it. Three additional lanterns. Let's punch out six windows. And then we'll just replace it later. I mean, come on, nobody will notice. Also need the candles. There you go. Oh yeah, I guess I do have some spare glass in the basement. We can't use the pulverizer, or we can't use the health hammer while we're using the pulverizer. That's, that's what I'm trying to say in so many words. Where do I want to put the entrance though? Let's put one like right here. Right here. So at least there's some light coming from that windmill area. Yeah, that works. You know what? I'm just gonna start lighting that area over there. I need those fence posts. If I can find them. I mean, I could just make more with the resources I have, but I'm pretty sure I had fence posts somewhere. Yeah, it's right here. So, we need to get some bloomeries up and running. We also need some... Probably should go get some fire clay. Like, let's put the lantern, like, all the way over there. Instead of concentrating all of our light in one area. Like, the fire is still... The light from the fire is still here. It is actually kind of annoying. 
Please light on fire and clear this up. Oh, I guess there's like nothing there except forest floor. Burn the cinnamon fern. Or you know what? Let's light this thing. There we go. So what I want is There, there we go. Get rid of these things floating in midair. Or better yet, one more. Come on. There we go. There we go. So, copper lantern. Lighting that thing over there. And this is finally going to go away. Same with you. Activity is low, so we're going to see some spawns eventually. But you know, look at this house. Doesn't it look nice? Probably could, like, put a lantern somewhere near the roof, but it looks nice. Alright. So, next thing we're gonna do... Yeah, we should roll out these fire bricks. Like, we did have, like, some... Uh, clear quartz that we can use. Like, let me just set this up first. And I guess let's get rid of these flowers. Put our bloomeries like right here. I do need to get rid of that roofing material though. can do six, but I'm going to need some quartz. Okay, so I'm thinking going back into that cave over there, dig out some more quartz. Try to get some silver in the process as well. And I'll, I'll just put these back here. And I'll put you here as well. And yeah, we'll do that. Okay, we are good. So, I have plenty of shovels. We won't do shovels. Instead, do pickaxe and the long blades. 